Why hello, I'm Noel, and you're watching A Day in My Life in Tokyo. So to begin with, we'll need to destroy some of the boxes here. Not destroy, but technically we need those barcodes here in order to apply for the Metal Bearing Drift campaign. Awesome! That's going to be a super powerful driver, and I'm looking at Takara Tomi's website now, and this is the second time that they're doing this campaign. And this time, there will be 300 winners. And you can apply as many times as you want, as long as you have barcodes of Beyblade products. Okay, so I have applied four times during the first campaign, and this time, we'll get to apply three times. So seven in total. Let's hope we'll get to see the driver. Okay. Ooh, <laughs> I don't know, it feels, feels weird cutting Beyblade boxes, but this process is necessary. <laughs> Look at this strange void here without the barcode. I don't know why, but I got rid of Xiphoid Excalibur's package and I'm really regretting that now. Okay, it's all done. Now we'll need to go to a convenience store or even a post office just to purchase some postcards so that we can send these. After that, I'm planning to watch a movie, maybe have something to eat, and then bay hunting. Okay, are you ready? Let's go! Three, two, one, go shoot! Hey guys, so we are at Nara Port Toyosu. Whoa, it's super hot. Summer in Japan. It's huge. I decided to have lunch now because I didn't want to hear my stomach rumble during the movie. So, oh, nice view here and here. Okay, let's go. We have arrived at the third floor of Lalaport Toyosu. Let's see if this toy store has the new Zesu Akiri's custom set. Oh wow, they do! They have the new Zest Achilles, also Xyphoid Excalibur. And they're still doing the Gold Driver campaign. Nice! If you purchase two Gold Romans, you get 20% off. Amazing. As for Zest Achilles, it's 3,299 yen. Nice. movie I'm watching is One Piece. Film Red. I'm so excited. Hey God, look at those keychains. So cool. They even have like nail cutters and oh, this metal keychain is also nice. I got this One Piece Film Red exclusive comic book. It's awesome. Oh my god, the movie was awesome! I'm just so excited! I'm still excited! I'm, I wanna watch it again! I've seen all the One Piece movies until this one, One Piece film Red, but this one is my new favorite. This was awesome! So if you're hesitating whether you should watch it, super recommend it, guys! Okay, this movie really made my day. Let's go to our next destination! Guys, look! This is my hometown, Toyosu! It's a bayside area in Tokyo. Sunny and super windy! So I came to the convenience store to purchase some postcards, but here's a fun fact. This 7-Eleven, it's actually the first 7-Eleven in Japan. Isn't that cool? <laughs> hey, so I just stopped by my house. Here's my uh... My friend, my good friend, my teddy bear, black, and I'm all dressed in white. And uh, oh, here, I'm currently working on something. So I'm now working on some projects, video editing. Here's the project for Zest Akinis, and this one is for the Adir. Here's the fine Beliadder. Nice. With the Adir, of course. 
is such an interesting gear. Here's the website for Takara Tomy and this is the driver we're aiming for and I'm in the middle of writing those postcards so basically we just need to write the address so it gets safely to Sakaratomi with these barcodes like tapes here and uh, this is pretty much it and after I edit some videos we'll be heading to our next destination so the place where I saw the one piece film red movie that was in Toyosu, Lara Port Toyosu and the place we're going next is called Kiba it's, um, it's not that far from Toyosu, so I think I'm planning to walk there. And I'm aiming for a jet wyvern because I don't have one. So our next goal today is going to be day hunting in Kiba, looking for a jet wyvern. Here we arrived. This is Kiba. And the place we're going now is called Ito Yokado Kiba. And uh, I'm looking for a post just to make sure um, I get these. Uh, postcards for metal bearing drift before we go to keep out for bay hunting and uh, ooh, I found it. Wish me luck. Let's go. Oh look, they have some kind of indoor bazaar. Interesting. <laughs> it's been a while since I came to this place and it's huge. So here's the toy section of Toyokado. Oh my god, look at all those capsule toys. There, 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 there. Wow, what is this place? Oh my god, I haven't seen this much capsule toys in my life. And it's here. Oh, look. This is awesome. Wow. Let's see their collection. They still have random booster volume 29. Oh, this Solomon! Nice, nice. It's very nice to have so many this Solomon. Can you see it? And, uh, Ramesh Fafi. Also, in the file. Random Booster 28. From his Valkyrie, we see the, um, this is Xyphoid Excalibur. Many Xyphoid Excaliburs. Also, Ivan Benya. And, uh, ooh, Gat Red Dragon, Silver Valkyrie. Where's the, um, Zesta Kiddies set. Oh, it's here. Zesta Kiddies. And this is 3,819 yen plus tax. And we can only purchase one Zesta Kiddies set. Um, they have a good stock. Oh, they even have the, uh, like the Overdrive special set. How much is it? It's 4,780 yen plus tax. I think this is the last one. They still have this exactly set along with the signal but no jet wyvern. Well, it's too bad we couldn't find jet wyvern. We'll have to keep going on our bay hunt journey. But uh, they did have a good selection. So if you're coming to Tokyo and you can go to Toyosu or even Kiba, this is the place I am now. It's also highly recommended. So um, I was thinking of purchasing something, but since I already have all the bays here, for today, we won't be purchasing anything, but still, it's always fun to do bay hunting videos. So I'm planning to do some bay hunting, going to stores that sell secondhand bay blades. So please look forward to that. And I'll keep you up to date about the metal bearing drift driver. Okay, so this is pretty much it for today. Thank you so much for watching.